Hi, my name is Carmen and I'm a student employee here at Washington State University's College of Agriculture, Human and Natural Resource Sciences. I'm here with two of our apparel merchandising design and textile students, AMDT, and we're here to talk to you about the AMDT program and what student life is here like at WSU. If you guys would like to introduce yourselves real fast. Yeah, sure. Hi, my name is Shelby Smith. I'm an apparel design student here at WSU and I'm from California. My name is Lainey Padelford. I'm an apparel merchandising and design student here at WSU and I'm from Prosser, Washington. <laughs> So what is the main difference between design and merchandising? Um, I would say the main difference between design and merchandising is design focuses on the creation of fashion. So that includes apparel assembly um, and other industry related uh, design processes such as Photoshop, Illustrator and InDesign. And then merchandising is like the buying and planning. Yeah, definitely. Merchandising is like the buying and planning. Um, it also includes things like digital mer or visual merchandising, which is setting up like store locations and just how it looks to a public eye. Uh, being in design and merchandising, I feel like I get to see both sides of that, and that's really fun. Awesome. Yeah, so what kind of equipment or tools does WSU provide for the AMDT program? So we have a 24-hour, seven-day-a-week access um, studio, which um, has sewing machines, sergers, and other um, stuff that design students can use. So what is the AMDT fashion show? It's the biggest thing that we have for AMDT every year during Moms Weekend, right? Mm -hmm. So what is that? The AMDT fashion show is a yearly event that WSU puts on, and their senior design students and other graduating designers get to showcase a fashion collection that they create, design, and find models for all themselves. It's, it's a really exciting event. We invite everyone to come, and it's just a really good time. <laughs> Have you guys been involved in the fashion show? Um, I've been involved as like press before, but this year I am modeling for Lainey, which I'm really excited <laughs> for and very honored by. So. Yes, and I'm designing this year. <laughs> you modeled last year, right? I did model last year. Was it fun? It was really fun. <laughs> it was kind of kind of stressful, but it was really fun. Nice. And so what clubs are you guys involved in, AMDT affiliated, um, or anything like that? Um, so I'm involved in two AMDT affiliated clubs. So that's the AMDT Fashion Club and the Lux Magazine Club. Um, the AMD fa AMDT Fashion Club is kind of just... Um, it's a very chill club. It's um, for AMDT students just to network and socialize, kind of get to know one another. Um, and the Lux Magazine Club is a fashion uh, magazine run by students for students. So everything in the magazine is um, edited, modeled, pho photographed, um, all by students at WSU. That's awesome. Are you guys in the same clubs? We're both in Lux. Nice. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you are a part of AMDT uh, Fashion Club. Not this year. Okay. <laughs> So why WSU for AMDT? Because it's not a fashion school. What set it apart and why did you choose WSU? For me, WSU seemed to offer this really unique perspective on the fashion industry. It wasn't just focused on super high fashion and it wasn't necessarily always focused on um, merchandising and uh, like technical fashion. It had kind of this middle ground that was really interesting, and it was located in somewhere like I never expected a fashion, uh, you know, school or fashion program to be. Um, I also think it's really interesting with its ties to different cotton, cotton um, producing plants like Cotton Incorporated, uh, and all of its connections to industry are really interesting, and it's kind of what made made me push to go to WSU. Yeah, I would say kind of the same. Um, I moved here from California um, just looking for something new. I've never lived in like the Pacific Northwest. Um, so when I was touring schools up here, I was shocked to, to learn that um, kind of like the middle of nowhere Washington <laughs> had a fashion program, um, which is something that I've always been interested in. So um, coming here and touring, I really liked that they had a big focus on sustainability. Um, like Lainey mentioned, we do work with Cotton Incorporated, um, and they are also really focused on sustainability within the fashion industry. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys taking time to be here with us and telling everyone how awesome AMBT is. If you want to find these ambassadors, you can find them on connors.wsu.edu or on our Instagram, Connors Ambos. Thanks, guys.